Legislative sessions entering the final leg of its busy biennium and with it a last chance for advocates to make their voices heard. That was the case today as dozens of members of Moms Demand Action, a gun legislation advocacy group. Quinn Gorm explains why they were there and the two bills they hope to see cross the finish line before the deadline. It's our advocacy day and that's just when we gather volunteers from all over the state to come and meet with their elected leaders and um, champion all of our gun sense legislation. Moms Demand Action took to the state capitol on Tuesday for a day of advocacy. So when I say action, you say now, action, yeah. action. Yeah. The group is a nationwide movement that advocates for gun legislation. But it's really become this much larger group. We, we say mothers and others. Um, and it's certainly a lot of survivors, people that have they're personally been affected by gun violence, either lost a loved one or have been injured themselves. This year, the group is looking to make the case for two laws, mandatory reporting of lost and stolen firearms and required safe storage of those firearms. We do not expect our legislators to fix all our problems, but we do elect them to at least try. Trying is what's currently happening in St. Paul. DFL lawmakers have introduced laws that would meet the group's demands. Currently, those bills are awaiting a floor hearing after being laid over for inclusion in a possible public safety policy bill later this year. We have a chance to pass this safe storage bill this year, but I need your help. I need you to make those phone calls. I need you to send those emails, and then I need you to go recruit some friends to do it. Inside the legislature, it's unclear right now what the fate of these bills will be. Republicans in a committee hearing last month had a decent amount of pushback on these two particular bills. And in 2023, there were a couple of last minute holdouts on gun legislation within the DFL as well. Still, nevertheless, advocates are not only hopeful, but energized about the prospect of these bills. One thing I know about moms demand action is that when moms demand action, Action better happen. Thank you so much for being here. In St. Paul, Quinn Gorham, KEYC News Now. Those who attended today's rally also spoke with their local senators in groups. Groups like the NRA have shown up in committee hearings to oppose this legislation. Well,